The number one contraindication, so that means the number one condition that you should not have laser eye surgery for is keratoconus. So keratoconus is a condition where your cornea is weaker than normal, it's thinner than normal, and when you do laser eye surgery, you're removing more tissue to make it even thinner. And that has the potential to make the keratoconus progress at a greater rate. So the idea of doing LASIK for keratoconus is absolutely taboo, you don't do it. What's interesting though is the treatment for keratoconus is cross-linking and what cross-linking does is to strengthen the cornea and the cornea is strengthened with cross-linking by a factor of between 80% and 4 or 5, 100%. So the cornea is much, much stronger after cross-linking whereas a surface laser treatment only reduces the corneal strength by about 5 or 10%. So what we do on occasion for the right person, so it's only after we've assessed the person and deemed them to be suitable for this, we do a procedure called SIMLC, simultaneous laser cross-linking. So on the day of surgery, we do a surface laser correction to improve the corneal shape and improve the vision, and then directly thereafter, followed by cross-linking that strengthens and stabilizes the cornea. So generally speaking, laser is not for people with, with keratoconus, but in a highly specialized clinic like this that deals with keratoconus, you can combine the two to give you a good stable outcome, but it's always going to involve cross-linking.